When I was in third grade, I started my own business, and from the very beginning, my uh, parents and Sunday school teachers both taught me that I should give 10% of all the money that I made. And so I started doing it right from the very beginning and throughout my entire life. And as I was growing up, I continued to do, uh, continued to tithe and continued to give offerings. And because of that, I've seen that God's continuously blessed my life. Um, you know, He's rebuked the devourer for my sake. I've continued to grow financially. Uh, my business has continued to prosper. And I believe that's all a result of my tithing. And I think it would have been more difficult if I wouldn't have started at a very young age. Because a lot of people say, oh, when I you know, make more money, I'll start giving. But I found that the more money I made, you know, I'm writing out bigger tie checks, and it, it doesn't get easier. But because I made the decision when I was, a, you know, younger, that I was going to give, it was a lot easier just to continue to do it. And now, as a result of my giving, God's blessed me um, in my job and also in my business. In my business, I've started a couple of real estate investing companies, and even in the, the tough market, the real estate market, I've been able to uh, acquire several properties and also to operate them all profitably. And I believe that you know everything I've seen in my life, um, all the blessings I've seen in my life, have all been a result of me tithing and offering and starting it at a young age and deciding, making the decision at a young age that no matter what, I wasn't gonna stop giving, I wasn't gonna tithe, stop tithing, but I would continue to obey, obey God's word, continue to give.